Hi, my name is Michael from Men's Finest. In this video, we're going to be trying to see if these bad boys, sharp and dapper, are any good. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If you have not subscribed yet, make sure you click that subscribe button. This is not my usual setting. But I can assure you that this video is going to be short and sweet to see if I can actually use them on my hanging shirt. So we'll see about that sharp and dapper um, set. So I've opened this set. This is what I've got. I've got some... Um, so in that box, sharp and dapper box, I've got these things. That look rather odd. So we'll see if we can somehow put them on. Okay, so what about that one? What do I do with them now? Apparently, all you have to do is, um, is attach these parts to your shirt. Well, some parts to your shirt and some parts to your socks. And somehow they should pull it together and work. Let's find out about that. So this, this, these are my shirt and my socks. So my beautiful socks. Uh, so I'll try to pull the shirt and see how does that work. Um, so I was supposed to take one of those and I think isn't that isn't so that three of those that three of those should actually go and be attached to a shirt and one of them to a sock. How do I undo that one? Ah, right, okay. It seems as if I just pull that one out, remove it like that. So I'll do the same for this one. So you attach it, you find the middle bit and you press it. And let's say you do the same in the back. So you do it, you attach it, and you press so you ended up with something like that okay so now the end bit the under bit it should go down and be attached to your socks so now the end bit is supposed to be attached to your socks so let's see how does that going to work so i'm going to go there and attach it to my sock you basically onto this one remove it Put it back on, and obviously that gives you less tension, so that's what you need. Right. I've got three parts to it. So I'm just going to go that part there, so somewhere in the middle, so like here maybe. And I think I'm ready to go. I'm not too sure myself when I'm 100% comfortable with how they sit at the moment. Kind of pulls everything. But if that stops me from having my shirt being untucked all the time, I'll take it any day, any time. The real test for that one, and I'll report on that tomorrow, is actually going to be tomorrow when I'm going to be wearing my braces. Uh, because usually on braces, that's where... Um, the shirt sort of sort of come out. So I'll try to do my braces tomorrow. I've got longer socks as well So that should keep it in place. I'm excited about tomorrow But let's take it for test drive today and I'll report the results when I come back <laughs> My shirt is going nowhere put it that way. My shirt is going nowhere bit of a Anselm belt action So the first test so those three four hours test that I had them on that was successful, so I'm happy with that. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to be testing that for the entire day. But if you look at the sort of bottom of um, my trousers uh, leg, you will see that there is uh, something running alongside it. Have a look. Uh, there is obviously something running down the leg. You can kind of tell that there's been something, there's something is like, there is some movement there. And it's very interesting. 
be very precise you will be able to tell that something is actually there it doesn't you know you won't be able to see it straight away but if you've got a very keen eye you'll be able to tell that there is that that ridge that difference there okay so day two of testing these bad boys from sharp and dapper and um, i've just removed them from yesterday's shirt they left absolutely no marks no scuffs and you know no ripped shirts anything like that uh, didn't happen so uh, so i'm going to be trying them on today uh, i will have my uh, trouser with suspenders therefore i need something that's going to keep my shirt tucked in uh, into that this is just a i think tim lewin shirt and a very white collar spread spread collar and uh, white shirt so i'm going to be wearing bow tie for this and i need those bad boys so let me see if i can put them on better than yesterday Let's try the trousers on. I must admit everything sort of is squashed and squeezed and pulled. That's what I like. I never had anything like that before. Never ever seen anything like that before. Shirt stays in. Love you, love you, love you, love you. Okay, second day of testing the sharp and dapper shirt stays. Um, and today was a very um, different day because I've tested those um, throughout the day. And also the most important test was they actually had a, a suspenders, a braces on. So if you wear braces, very often what happens is the, um, you know, the shirt's going to come out of your trousers. So what you had then have to do is constantly adjust and pull the pants up uh, and make sure that the shirt goes down and you tuck in the shirt. And every time you do any motions, you'd have to do all of that all the time. And it's pretty annoying and it's pretty obvious that you're not then comfortable uh, with your shirt and, and uh, suspenders so so that's always an issue when you wear braces now how did I feel today wearing sharp and dapper stuff uh, I didn't have that problem like it is simple as that uh, with my braces on I was just I, I, I wasn't even bothered I knew the shirt's gonna stay in it's not going to come out anywhere. Uh, it just makes me happy. So, again, the test has passed. There was no removal of of, um, of either shirt or socks. The socks stayed on all, all, all day. The shirt stayed on all day. I mean, what else do you want? Like, it's ideal. And it actually didn't affect me that much. At times, I just forgot and I had it. Which is weird, because I thought initially that's going to give me a bit of a headache. So that's good. So I'm happy. It's test day number three tomorrow. Let's see what happens tomorrow. Okay, my final thoughts on the Sharp and Dapper product. Um, I have tested this today without... Um, without those shirts today. So I basically said, okay, let me just go out there with uh, my normal 
uh, chinos and a shirt and a uh, blazer kind of suit jacket situation and I thought okay I'm not gonna actually put these on so let's see if in comparison to yesterday whether I'm gonna feel better worse the same whether I'm gonna feel discomfort or not bizarrely I actually missed them I was um, irresistibly checking uh, whether my shirt is out whether you know whether it, it, it comes out from the back or from the sides um, I, I was annoyed by my socks slipping down my leg um, you know I, I, I was aware of them I was aware that I didn't have anything I didn't have them um, so I guess the final thought on this realm is that I really like them uh, I really like them. I think they are going to become essential part of my wardrobe. I'm going to be using them um, every time. I'm going to be probably wearing uh, my dress shirts and my suits. They're just going to make you make you feel as if you don't have to worry about your shirt coming out, and that was always the worry. Um, so Sharp and Dapper, Johan Eckelund, thank you so much for those. These are the lifesavers, so I highly recommend this company, Sharp and Dapper. Uh, Johan, I love you forever, man. This is great invention. Five star to Johan and Sharp and Dapper. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you soon.